Hello, dear friends. Uh, today, just I would like to give some guides how to uh, install the mold without in the uh, NX and how to install the and generate the library for the mold without like the field lifters, the mold uh, itself, and so on. How to obtain this one? For the beginning, uh, this is our NX, and here you can see uh, the toolbox for the mold. So it is called the mold wizard and uh, here just uh, right click here and uh, from here you can uh, uh, activate your the mold wizard here you see it is activated and uh, you can uh, disactivate so it is uh, disappeared and uh, right click here in the ribbon and uh, if you click here the mold wizard is activated and somehow here uh, we have some uh, standard parts in the mold wizard like see here the sliders lifters or the mold base itself or some here the standard parts library so uh, in the generally it does not work uh, when you activate the mold wizard so you have to for the beginning the download the mold wizard library and uh, install it and uh, to for the properly properly working for example uh, here in my the cases it is already working and here in the reuse library you see here the mold wizard library is already existed and here the several molds here you see in the lower part several ex uh, existing molds is already installed uh, not only the molds also other parts is already existed here you see the the standard parts for the the mold and so on so now i would like to see to, to show you how to do, do this kind of the settings for the beginning, so uh, you have to download the mold wizard library here. I use the, this uh, the website in the uh, Siemens, uh, this uh, mold wizard or die design the libraries here. Uh, it is a torrent file in the description of the of the, this video. I will uh, upload also the, this uh, torrent file. You can uh, easily the download it. So after the downloading it, it is, uh, for example, uh, it's located here in my the uh, D drive in disks here, for example, you can uh, uh, put here. And if I open here, you see the mold design library already exists here. So here exists. And here you see the, all the standard files is the, the located here. It is after downloading. So then you have to just, uh, Select all the files. Uh, then select all the files and go to the C drive. For example, I will show here the select and the, the copy the all the uh, folders here and uh, select uh, this all and the say uh, the copy all the files and go to the C drive. Uh, so go to the C drive and uh, go to the program files. And uh, here in the program file, go to the, the Siemens folder. Here you see the Siemens folder, and here the go to the, the, the NX11, and the, here the mold wizard. Uh, you can uh, create the mold wizard folder, and just uh, the copy and paste all the files which is the uh, copied and paste here the old file. You see, this is the old list uh, passed here. So. This is the first step, and the, in the second step, you have to create the variable of the mold wizard. In order to do this, just uh, here, the you go to the the, the edit uh, environment variables of your the computer. So here, and the environment variables here, in the system variables, you have to create this one. Just a moment, I will show here. Uh, it is the all the created here. Mia, here you see you have to. This is all of the created in my cases. You have to create the new one. So the new one, you press the new one. In the when you press the new one, you will be obtained at this window like this. And here you have to write this one mold wizard here like this. And here you have to the specify the location of the folder of the other mold wizard, which is the in the D disk. For example, here this is this one. I will show you how to the to do this one. You have to go to the your the D drive. Where you the save your the mold wizard? Let me uh, go here. This one, which is the you downloaded this one, 
and the go inside of the, this one, move the dart and go to the inside of the, this one, again, this one. When you are the here, just uh, the press the, your the mouse here, you see, it is the directory of the, your the, this uh, folder and just copy this one and uh, pass this the, the copy this one here and just press OK. And you see the then you, this variable will be created. So just press OK and just press OK. Then after the, the reboot your the computer, so then it will be the appear this kind of standards on your the uh, on your the the NX mold wizard, and you can easily use the, these ones to create uh, molds and so on. So thank you very much for the attendance, and uh, I I think that uh, this tutorial will be the very helpful for you and uh, for the future works and so on. Don't forget to subscribe my the channel to get the more the useful informations on the NX and SolidWorks and so on.